my name is Valar Mathi and I am from Kanyakumari. I wanted to just tell a few things about me, how I joined the NTTF. Actually, I am from a rural place that uh, people will be not thinking great about diploma and all, right? Then I got to know NTTF uh, through my cousin. So he actually studied here and he told that uh, he got placed. I, ha I can witness him, you know, after college he joined in a big company called Vipro and he was doing his career successfully. Then I wish to join in NTTF after my 10th. And I feel that is a good opportunity. So I joined in 2017 in electronics group. Uh, why I have selected this particular group is because people were telling about uh, more placements will be available in electronics and more opportunities. And I thought, okay, let me go to electronics field and learn about it. First day I was so nervous, I would say. And uh, I'm from I'm from a place where um, women are not gonna get out and study and all. During the day when I joined, I told my mom, please take me back. <laughs> and I was like zero in English and I, I'm, I'm not sure how to communicate with others, right? Now I'm in front of people and I'm able to speak uh, confidently and uh, you know, I, I'm like, I'm feeling very good, right? All these things happen because um, how the college have made me. So I, I felt so happy to be part of Integria. I would say that uh, people has to come out, especially women has to come out and uh, has to be empowered and, and during the three years of my college, right, it's not about learning only on the technical steps, right, got to know many people who come from different state, I want, it's like good environment to work with, you know, learn few things, cultures from them. So when I joined here, I was not able to speak in English, I was not, I was just sticking to my na native language, right? My friends are Telugu and everybody is like at other languages. So now I'm able to speak Kannada, Telugu and every language, right? I'm from a family where, um, you know, I think I'm the first girl who studied uh, and who came out from the family. When I'm coming, going back to native, right? So many people will be asking me what you have studied to become a successful in your career and now you are taking care of your family and all. When I joined, I'm remembering my relatives and whoever neighbors, right? They used to tell, why diploma? There is no opportunity in diploma. But now when I'm going back, right? Everybody is like, can you give the contact number? Let me just inquire about it. I would say that as a woman, we have to be empowered. Uh, in NTTF, I would say uh, um, technical, practical theory sessions will be there. Actually, the practical sessions are more here compared to the engineering which we are pursuing. Um, so many engineers who come from IITs and IITs and all. Uh, actually, um, we are actually equivalent to them. And diploma is a good course and it's a good practice people has to follow and in your early age, you can able to earn. So I got placed in Texas Instruments. I, uh, I did my internship there. So 2020, I got placed then i got a full-time employee i would say the preparation wise um, that time i was little nervous on that but now i'm little clear on how students have to prepare for interviews uh, we have to be a little bit strong on the fundamentals which we have learned uh, i think problem solving is the one more skill that people has to adopt i think that is also um, many teachers here have taught me and yeah, it, this really helped me to placed in a big company in my early age and I was working there for like 4.5 years now. Now I am pursuing my BTEC in Bixvilani uh, using a work integrated learning program. Actually, uh, I saw my cousin that who was very successful in career through NTTF so I just followed him and after, when I was doing my uh, studies and when I got placed right then I got to know that this is actually a best convenient way I would say it's not a very hard way because when you do a B right you don't know actually what you're learning but now I'm doing a BTEC with a career background as well as a diploma background so I know what to learn I feel that is what very important so that clarity is there as a, st as a student who completes 10th and 11th and 12th if they are going to a BE they will not be having any idea what they are going through right but when uh, I think this way is more clearer and more convenient because we know what to study and we know where it will be used so I would recommend people to take up this way this route it's not about paragraph which we learned or it's not about the book which we have just mug up right uh, so diploma it's, it's like 
50 60 percent practical sessions right you will be doing a hands on so you know what to do that is what you will be going and doing in your professional life as well from the electronics background you know how to operate a oscilloscope you know how to use a dm before you actually get into the professional route i would say many engineering colleges uh, students who have come out they didn't have a practical sessions how we have so I think that is the advantage I feel NDTF is actually doing a great role in that, uh, conducting a practical sessions. In engineering colleges, I think nobody has heard of 5S and actually it is a part in a professional life, you have to do 5S before you start a work, right? So I think this discipline at all comes over this course and I, it's not only about a technical thing, it's all about a package of everything, technicality, professional and how the confidence which builds. Thank you.